day is coming up Sunday, April 22nd. It's a day to help end pollution through various events worldwide. In Pittsburgh, there are several ways to go green with several days leading up to Earth Day. And our next guests are here to talk about one of those events. It's the annual Earth Day event called Ecolution, where design and sustainability connect. This year's event features 18 designs at the Fairmont Pittsburgh with fashions from material like packing tape, bubble wrap, and other upcycled items. The event is curated by Richard Parsakian and styled by Azazu Salon Spa in Serata. We are pleased to get a first look at the fashions with Richard and Emilio of Azazu. Good morning. Good morning. Good Thank morning. You. So this is the fourth year, and every year there's a theme. What is the theme this year? Mm -hmm. uh, this year is Forces of Nature. Um, I uh, want to respond to what's happening in the world and between politics and uh, sustainability. Mm -hmm. So um, I asked each of the designers to use that as an inspiration. They could use it as an abstract theme or very literal. Very nice. And how many designers do you work we with have, for these? This year we have 18 designers. Yeah. yeah, we have 18 this year. And it's really great because like the first year, seeing the uh, the evolution of Ecolution yeah. has been really, really amazing. See it grow. Oh my gosh. Five years ago we were over at Richard's place, Deb Doherty, uh, Ron and Zigarelli, myself and, and, and Richard brainstorming this and we are so excited to see the movement and how it's come with uh, the reusing and and repurposing of materials well know. i'm so happy that you guys worked so hard this morning to bring some of the models in so we can kind of get a sneak peek at what people will see okay. at this yeah. year's evolution so who did you bring in for us who's first uh, the first uh, model is terence austin who is uh, wearing a piece uh, designed by vanessa german okay. Um, Vanessa is, if anybody uh, doesn't know her, she is a force of nature in Pittsburgh. She's a Pittsburgh-based <laughs> artist. Mm -hmm. um, her uh, line of jewelry is called uh, The Body Beautiful. Uh, it is a, this, these are her words. It is a sculpturally romantic exploration between the body of the earth and the human body. It celebrates the power, resilience, and spirit of black people and our living and ancestral connections to the earth. We are celebrating the dynamic and ins inspiring biodiversity of the earth in these aspirational sculptures. That all human beings can live and thrive in the diverse luminosity of their own humanity. And Vanessa does great work and she will be there mm -hmm. yes. that night as yes. well with yes. a spark spoken word. With right? a spoken word piece. Um, uh, her spoken word piece is called The Earth's First Language is Love. Mm. Yeah. So that's like a force of nature too. Right. If you think about it, Heather, you know, forces of nature are many things that are like kind of uncontrollable. Right. So love is one of those things as well. Absolutely. <laughs> so who do we have up next? Okay. Uh, next we have, um, we have Katie uh, Dement. Yes. Katie Dement. Designer Katie Dement. Um, this theme was, she, it's Katie D. Meant said, you know what, air. She wanted to have something mimic with air. So that's why uh, the Doherty model was Anna Opka. And uh, hair was done by, by Carol Piccolino. If you notice, like with the bubble wrap and the sway and the flow, it kind of mimics that airy kind of feel. And we did the same thing with the hair to complement it, where the hair, Carol Piccolino waved, did some light waves and textures with her fingers, and then did like a little bit of a dry um, spray, texture spray to create that sort of airiness. And then the makeup was done by Maisie where if we go up to see the show the makeup now look at the that that whole bubble wrap think about how cool that is right. that that was all done with with bubble wrap and the packing tape and packing yeah. tape yes and the makeup and, is like very um, airy <laughs> right yes yeah yes. now the the key thing Maisie did here which i thought was brilliant is she used all highlight contour to create the effect. Mm -hmm. So she did silver and grays in the eyes, and then the one thing with the lips was she did a nude lip and then used like some glitter in the center to kind of make it have that effect, that, that popping effect or that sort of a, ethereal like movement to the look. Really beautiful. And, and uh, just very quickly, uh, Katie is a uh, uh, teaching um, artist at the Pittsburgh Center for uh, uh, for a creative reuse. It sounds like you guys yes. have a lot of great designers and oh, using yeah. some great materials as well. So what do we have now, next? Next, Forces of Nature, designer Electric Catfish, new on the scene. Oh. And uh, very cool. She wanted to do something that was more like, uh, like more uh, women warriors, like how we would kind of describe yeah. that. Really how did she love. say? This, this piece is so cool. uh, entitled Strong, Powerful Woman Warrior, A Force to Reckon With. Mm -hmm. And the technique she used, if you notice, with her technique was called Boro, which means to mend. It's a Japanese technique. So she takes all reused, like you can take your 
old jackets and bring them to her and she'll she'll create this mending technique and, and add texture to it, right? Some and of then, the pieces in the in the work are cell phone. It's a cell phone ad vinyl that she cut up and used. Wow. Mm -hmm. uh, wood family slides and repurposed textiles. She works in leather and in denim also. Yeah. So she creates fashion normally. And yes, so she, she has her own Etsy store. Right, mm -hmm. great. And um, you know, then the look she, you know, we, we did to complement the hair was uh, Kimberly Miller did what we call Viking style, because you know, <laughs> bold and, 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 and that whole boldness. So she did several braids, pulled them apart, used like a dry, a trick if you're doing braids, you want to create this, is take dry powder shampoo and powder it in and then pull it apart. And it creates that extra texture. Oh, that you wouldn't get from a spray, and then Ma Maisie did the. Uh, oh, and then uh, and then if he's noticed the headdress, again, f uh, portraying that tough bull is kind of what she described it as. And then naturally the makeup, Maisie did bold, you know, again to fit the whole theme of her look and uh, structured bold makeup. Eyes were bold red. Notice that strong red. It's not blended at all. It's like here I am, you know. Um, and then the lips were navy blue, and then it looks like just that little shade of purple on the edge to kind of give it that whole look. Less for work, more for runway. <laughs> no, exactly. <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> you guys Definitely can do it all, runway. Right? <laughs> yeah. and, uh, and by the way, we have some really special things Richard put together this year um, for the runway. Also, which... beyond Vesa German's uh, spoken word piece, we have Waylon Gomez, who's going to do a dance solo. That's cool. Oh, yeah. Um, that's cool. And then um, we have Miss Theatrix, our local drag queen, who's going to be Storm. And Texture Contemporary Ballet will perform uh, a work. So it's a full evening experience uh, yes. with amazing uh, Pittsburgh based artists. Well, because let's talk about this because this mm -hmm. event really, it's about awareness, it's about mm -hmm. really thinking about Mother Earth, but mm -hmm. also, I mean, it's a celebration, it's a big party starting with a VIP hour. Yes. Right, yep. We have uh, Bloom Honey Water, which uh, they're creating a really cool drink uh, called the Bacardi Bloom and the Nut and Honey Mai Tai. <laughs> so, good. and again, these are forces of nature. So, right. we thought, you know, uh, Rhonda from Acrobatic thought that that would be a good. A good and fit we for have it, uh, right? Kelsey Robinson in Geneva performing, and we have DJ Selecta. So uh, it'll be a, a, an experience uh, as soon as you walk in the door. And Renee Pyatt uh, will right. be showcasing her jewelry. That's great. Um, so she has that some is great another stuff. Fashion show is at seven, but there is an after party as well. Fashion show will be probably more seven thirty. Okay. Um, and definitely uh, the event goes on till eight o'clock. That's great. Yep, and uh, it'll probably go well into at least past ten. Oh wow! So. <laughs> Late night, guys. Well, thank <laughs> you Thursday. both for coming here and, and Thanks, showing Summer. us some of the fashions. Great work. It sounds like such a wonderful event. And you can come to this year's Pittsburgh Earth Day events citywide, including Ecolution Fashion Show at the Fairmont Pittsburgh from six until ten on Thursday, April nineteenth. Other Earth Day events include Paint the Square Green in Market Square on Saturday, April twentieth, for a full day of vendors and live music, along with a sustainable. Sip Pub Crawl. Look for more on these events and others on the Pittsburgh Earth Day website.